Hey guys, hope you're all well and welcome to this commission completion video. We've got an absolute treat for you today. This is a really nice Lord of Change that we've had the pleasure of working on for one of our clients. Uh, it's been completed by Kev, one of the artists here at Siege. Let's dive on in and have a look at all the awesome details that are on this model. Uh, so when these new kits came out, they were you know, really, really dripping with detail. There's so much stuff all over them. And uh, we'll just give a first of all, just to turn it around slightly so you can just see all the different areas of detail just from, from a sort of distance. And then we'll go in and have a look. Uh, as you can see on the wings to start off with, what Kev's done is obviously just a load of freehand work of stars and galaxies and things all over the wings. Some really nice areas of transitional colour so that the wings actually change in hue from sort of purples and pinks all the way through to a deep blue, through to a green and a light sort of turquoise as well in different areas. Uh, just to give it that really ethereal or magical kind of feel that you'd expect with a demon uh, within 40k. Um, and obviously Sigma as well. So moving around, as you can see, all the different areas of detail. There is so much detail on these models. It's absolutely dripping. Uh, and uh, we'll just zoom in a little bit on this piece here so you can have a look at some of the freehand work that's actually been done. Uh, so as you can see there, no expense has been spared. There's been loads and loads of attention to detail on this and all the different areas of the detail throughout the model, the gems, the lenses. There, there are It's dripping with gems uh, throughout this, this model, as you can see. So they've all been individually painted, multiple highlights and given real depth depth on all those stones, point of light source, uh, and as you can see on that bit on the back, loads of intricate little freehand patterning as well has also been done throughout the uh, throughout the different bit, little bits of armour that are on the uh, on the model. Uh, if you look here, for example, on the waist, if we zoom in a little bit, just get that to focus, you can see all the areas of sort of freehand sort of, uh, sort of detailing work that's been done on that belt section there. Uh, just get that to zoom out a little bit so you can see it from afar. Uh, and then probably one of my favourite pieces on this model is actually this planet on the end of the staff. So we'll just get this to zoom in for you a little bit put forward uh, and you can see there Kev's emulated planet Earth or Terra uh, or you know any old planet that looks like Terra but uh, but I would, I would like to think that it's, uh, it's Terra given obviously it's chaos and um, and as you can see it's actually got all cloud clusters throughout the planet, uh, land masses, uh, there's multiple highlighting throughout to give sort of like the, the, the appearance of depth and height on the, uh, the, the actual surface of the, uh, the terrain on that planet so as you can see there and uh, it's just a really really nice end to the soft, it's completely custom as well which is really, really cool. And, uh, you know, there's been some extra work that's been put in there as requested by the client. So we're just gonna move this back a little bit just so you can get from afar. As you can see, all the areas of highlighting and all the metal work on the sword, on the staff, um, on the skin, on the flesh, as you can see there. And then moving around, uh, the wings, just get a huge model as well, guys. I'm just trying to get it all on the camera for you. But as you can see, on both sides of the wings, you've got all those different transitional, sort of really ethereal color changes from greens to blues, to the turquoises, to purples and pinks. Uh, and then obviously, the You've got all the stars and things that have been done on top of that as well. And uh, and then we'll just move it around back again, get a nice view on the back again for you guys. Uh, it's a really, really nice piece. And, uh, you know, a lot, of, a lot of time has been put into this model from Kev uh, on behalf of for the client. Uh, and then we've done a little bit of a, of a sort of more of a, the client requested more of a sort of a, a sort of detail base just for, for the sort of a, like a character model, which is obviously what this guy is. And uh, we've done some, like, some tentacles with a bit of a glow to them as well as per the request of the client. And uh, yeah, just some really really cool little features use a bit of a basing kit as well and uh, some scenery just to really give him a very dominant and commanding kind of base uh, as you can see there but great model get get the, the head zoomed in so you can see all the eyes teeth flesh everything all picked out um, multiple highlighting on that tongue and uh, all the eyes are sort of got a really nice glow effect as well just very subtle just to make them look like there's energy ensuing in his, in his, his eyes um, but yeah as you can see dripping with detail loads and loads if you're thinking of getting one of these models you really really recommend it they're lovely and um, and the new GW sculpts are absolutely brilliant, and uh, obviously it's a plastic kit. It's just it's just brilliant. Um, so yeah, it's a great project. Really, really nice um, model, as you can see here. And uh, we've uh, we've had an absolute pleasure working on it, and uh, it's now going to be sent off to the client. If you are looking to get a character uh, done, then you know we do specialise with characters. It's something that we are very very sort of very passionate about, uh, and you know we do armies, we do characters, we do everything. But you know when it comes to doing characters, we really go to town uh, on on your behalf as a client. So if you are interested in a commission, uh, please drop us an email through our website www.siegestudios.co.uk. Go onto the contact tab, fill in the contact form, and we'll get the ball rolling. And uh, yeah as always guys i hope you like the video it's been a great project to work on and uh, as always drop us a, a subscribe or a comment or something it really helps us out because uh, we like chatting to you guys and we like you guys seeing what we get up to in the studio so thanks so much hope you like this one it's been awesome and uh, we'll see you guys on the next one take care bye bye